Hello to everyone who wandered this deep into the internet. Time to talk about a serious issue, veterans. Namely, how many veteran animations could be fit into a single car's turn. Yeah, sure, we might even see a couple drawing casual play, lovingly veteraning, maybe not competitively, but that's not nearly enough. Let me introduce to you Panzer 1B. One might ask what one card can do, but Panzer 1B is never really just one card. They come in flux. And the plan is to give them blitz and eat them up for cheap as much as we can. And there are ways to do that. But wouldn't the frontline just get stuck with major 1Bs, blocking out the rest, getting us stuck with only 5 veteran animations and just different shady ways to scrape out 9, maybe 10? Let me introduce you to Karachev, the natural enemy of the Panzer 1B. Even its background is but the spilled blood of the 1Bs, and with that on the opposing side, we can get rid of 1Bs as fast as we get them. Bearing some animation time issues, which surely won't become a problem. So the question becomes, how cheap can we get the 1Bs to work, and how much do we have to spend? The first method I show you is based on free Fs and grief over where my time went. As you can see from this pro and not at all wasteful gameplay, we can have 24 credit stops, and we could gain back 8 as we go from iron, because uh, with that we could avoid the sleepiness that would naturally come with iron deficiency. Additionally, we could amass uh, 7 1Bs on board beforehand uh, while still having the setup, but this would uh, disable us from any uh, Volker uh, gain, making Wagner just as uh, useless as he usually is. With 1 1B a pop and 7 for free, that would come up to 39 animations. So why does my board look jankier? Animation time. It doesn't really matter, because of animation time, we only got to 8 animations anyways. Now, this could have been played a bit better for one or two more animations, but there is just a better way to do the whole thing. Uh, we can get uh, one base eating to work for so cheap, it should be illegal, free. And the way to do that is support column to make them drag their ass up for free, and pattern to make them deploy free with blitz. The key card that I definitely did not forget to play. There is an additional benefit uh, this way, we won't uh, make an F-face German main deck. So the new limit is still the animation time and we only got 7 this time around. But forgetting about that cap, which is apparent when the new zombies are hovering above the board unwilling to cooperate just yet, this could have been 50. 99 half because of normal breed gameplay and 2 damage per one B because of S support. This 50 hit for the lethal and the theoretically possible lethal that couldn't be played because of animation time. But we can do even better, although 1B says it has to do uh, damage to the HQ for its effect to trigger, right now that's just not the case. We can reduce the damage to zero and still have the effect trigger, therefore we could watch 1Bs go to transform and die for nothing. And we could have gotten away with it if it weren't for those pesky timers and their dog. I'm gonna put the import code uh, for the two decks needed for the infinite eating down in the description, but you can see the decks on the screen right now as well. Let me know in the comments how many animations did you squeeze out of this in practice. Uh, thanks for watching, especially thanks for brainstorming and gameplay to Shale, Nav, and Short.